You ask what's my truck? I tell you the type trying to truck. One more time. This is my type of truck I want. Right there. See that? Right there. The Peterbilt 379. That's what I want. Right there. Y'all notice the price, right? Know the year. 2000 Peterbilt, right? That's a little bit up a little bit, but hey, I can deal with that. You come out of this one. This is a 1997, 379. It got a little bit bigger sleeper, a 63 inch sleeper compared to the 48 sleeper, right? Notice the price. These fools want $205,000 for this one. See? Get a close up of it. For what? Because you claim it's fully rebuilt, new seats. It's just 51 miles on the engine and transmission. Do you think to get an engine fully rebuilt, it's going to cost you $137,000 to rebuild this engine? Same engine. See? Cap. See? Why in the world will this truck, which is a 2000, and this truck that is a 1997, cost 130, what, 33,000 dollars more? I don't care what you put on this here truck. I don't care because the truck got a nice paint job and you didn't paint it the uh the gas tanks, and that one is not for a new paint job it's not going to cost $137,000 it, it's not it, 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 it really won't it really won't I, I, I don't care what you say it really won't you can come up here and get a car hauler with the uh, Peterbilt 2007 Peterbilt for $75,000 all right, C15, 48. I buy that. Okay. And take the car hauler stuff off and sell the car hauler stuff off to get my money back. You can sell the car hauler stuff probably for a good $15,000. Maybe more, but if you want to do it quick, so why would I pay that? See what I'm saying? Stuff, st stuff like that. Stuff like that that don't be making no sense. It, re it really don't. Look at this one. You could come and get that one. Okay? For 79. That's a 2005. For 79. Why would you want to go out and pay that? But guess what? Somebody is going to go out and pay that. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody is. Somebody really going to go out and pay that. Somebody going to have a hard on for a truck and go out and pay that. They, 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 they really are. They really are. But I, you can find a good deal of stuff like this. For me, this is going to wait. All right. I want this particular model right here because I still can go to some places that I go that is a tight fit because of uh, the wheelbases and stuff. Okay. So, uh, see that 245-inch uh, wheelbase? So, that's why I want this particular model and things like that because of the turning radius when well, you got a little bit longer one okay a little bit harder getting inside of some places it, it, it just is but 
But you know, like I say, I'm trying to establish my business first. All right, before I go out, get these in trucks and put that money in. It don't make no difference what your truck look like. If you don't have nothing to pull behind that truck, it's doing you no good. It's doing you no good. You out here on the road paying all that money for that truck and you can't get no loads. And you're crying about your rates on this in spot market. Okay? And that's the difference. I'm spending my first couple years establishing myself. I am. I'm not calling about rates or crying about rates because the brokers that I'm established relationships with and I'm working out these deals with, all right, with these shippers. I'm outside the little McDonald's thing. But uh, where I'm going to get this stuff at, okay, this is for my business for the long haul. So I'm not sitting around here crying about spot market rates because I have direct shippers that I'm doing for. And this is just a warehouse move from one warehouse to the other warehouse from McDonald's, okay? That's all it is. Okay, 900 bucks to go 170 miles. And then I'm back home. That's it. Could I got more? I probably could have got more, but to get this, every this rate every time i do this hello okay for the time period i told i could do this for a couple months but i'm gonna take one sunday off a month because i go to church um they want me to do this long term they actually offered me two more days out of this this week um so to do three loads a week for them but at 900 dollars a pop for those uh, three particular loads. But uh, I don't do Florida only. If I did Florida only, maybe because I'm home every night. You know, I'm getting up, waking up at six o'clock to get on the road and I'm home by five o'clock every single night. You know, and that's three nights a week, a load at $900. So when people tell y'all, hey, Florida don't pay, Florida do pay. Florida just don't pay them. Okay, sometimes you got to do work, but that's business. You got to make phone calls. You actually got to do some work. And this business stuff is not going to be handed to you. You actually got to do some work. Okay, it may take you a month or two to establish a relationship, but once you establish that relationship and you proved yourself to some people, then you could get those particular rates. This is just 174 miles that I'm going for 900 bucks. Okay.